all on. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Put me some of that royalty. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And what the goddamn hell, your league? So, we are about to get into this video. This video is actually about Lou. Um, she went live yesterday on TikTok, and apparently she is going live today. Um, as well, tonight at 11 o'clock, to be exact. So... We definitely going to be there for the live. But anyway, she basically putting out, she's talking about what Tay said yesterday. But basically trying to say Tay was lying or whatever. And, um, you know, that's what she said. And that's where we at. <laughs> so we about to get into this video. You dig what I'm saying? Let's do this. Let's do this. If the headphones can work properly, I think we're freaking good. All right, let's get it. I didn't want to be rude. I didn't want to, um, I'm sorry, I was yelling. I didn't want to be rude because if I end the live, then his um, MVP list disappear and I wanted him to be able to say thank you to his people. So <laughs> it's fine, you guys. He's definitely. So you guys. At this time, it, it looked like she was getting a bit frustrated about um, her comments, because everybody was coming to her comments telling her what Tay just said. What's the 411? What's the hot new gossip? <laughs> um, thank you so much, Casino. Oh, another no pun intended. God damn it, what a stream. Y'all, I don't know, y'all. I have too many blessings to be stressed about this. Yeah, I can't be stressed over false... I can't. I, I got. I got. I. I gotta say this, y'all. Listen, I have been in Lou's shoes, right? And it always brings me back around this time of the year when somebody done got exposed for something that they doing that they don't want to admit to doing. And the thing is, it's no reason for you to lie, friend, because first of all, you gotta know that somebody is gonna be you know screen recording a situation to have a better situation especially when you're the aggressor right now not only with you being the aggressor you watched her film you you watched her film you and i think that she didn't think that she was gonna expose her you know i think it was kind of a situation that was like you know she ain't gonna do that so i'm just gonna say this what it is and i'm gonna stick with that no calling tay a narcissist while doing narcissistic things y'all is one of the the one of the worst type of narcissist that you can be but i am not a fan of the narcissist word i could care less about it i just feel as though she needs to come out and tell the truth now she's forced to tell the truth now she's gonna do one or two things she's gonna come out and be like listen i had to she had just hit me something she may lie i hope she don't but hopefully she just standing that shit and just say yeah that's what it was you know hurt people hurt people and apologize you know what i'm saying for for what you did friend because what you're doing right now is absolutely not gonna go in your favor at all you know and I'm always the aggressor in anything that I do. You know what I'm saying? Anything that I do, I'm going to be the aggressor because naturally I just, I say what I want. I say it how I want. And a lot of times I don't, I mean what I say, but I don't mean to say it how I say it. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> I just wanted to put that out there because I've been in her shoes, but let's just keep going. I can't. So all we can do is just wish luck. So how you gotta talk to me about something other than this or else I'm gonna get off only because y'all y'all can go over there because I'm not gonna really <laughs> honey I've already cleared my name the the YouTube was released already on Tay and Lou's channel so my Easter plans I'm not even gonna hold y'all whenever I think about Easter I get this fever in my soul because I and what she's talking about with that video is the video that um tay made herself look like 
basically she was the absolute problem. When it's not just one person that's the problem, it's always two people that's a problem. I was the kid who literally, I played no games when it came to Easter. <laughs> 922 people on here right now. 142,000 likes. I'm not really a holiday girl, so I really don't have a favorite holiday. I feel like holidays make people feel bad, like for Christmas. If you don't have a family to wake up to, that makes people feel bad, I don't prefer it. Valentine's Day, if you don't have a lover, that makes people feel bad, I don't prefer it. I don't like when people, no offense, I don't even like when people post their birthdays because some people don't have people celebrating them. So, yeah, I don't even post my birthday. So, I don't really like that type of stuff because I feel like it alienates people. That's just such a, a dark way to look at it. But I will say everybody is not into holidays. So, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, Lou, you lying. I hope y'all do all know why I'm here. Can y'all give Des Destiny a gift sub, please? I hope y'all do know why I'm here. So after that, she got off the live. Um, Y'all, this wasn't much. I just wanted y'all to see that she denied whatever's going on. That is not, that's not a good thing to do. And I I just pray tonight when she go live, she just admit to her shit, man. And granted, it takes two to tango. You know what I'm saying? I can't say Tane play her part in it because that ain't what I'm saying. But I, I, what I will say is Lou was cool with putting Tay under the bus, but not cool with rolling herself up under there. And, you know, that's just not a type of person that you want to be around, though. Like, for real. I just, you know, I'm not here to judge neither one of them. I, like I said, I've been in Lou's shoes. So, I'm just trying to, you know, if Lou could see, like, you got to be better than that. You know what I'm saying? And I hope she realizes that. And I hope she just owns up to it, apologize for it, and move the hell on. Because if you don't do that, she's going to be right back in the situation that she was already in. You know, which was stress, pain, and, you know, projecting pain on another person physically. Um, and like I said, I've been there. And it is not a good feeling, man. And it's absolutely not a good feeling to not tell the truth. And it's not a good feeling to just not stand on your shit you know what i'm saying if somebody call you out on your shit and they have receipts to prove it come on at some point you gotta be like all right i did it you know what i'm saying like i, I don't understand i just don't understand y'all and i i wish that um she would kind of own up to her shit and, and not victimize this and you know let it be known that tay played a part you know as well it don't have to just be all her fault you know, and I feel like that's how she see it. Just take some damn accountability for the things that you did. You you can only be accountable for yourself. You know what I'm saying? But y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. That's really all I have. I'm praying for both of them, to be honest with y'all. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.